This is the best rated and this is the worst rated barber in the area. And this coin toss determines who goes where. Just for head or tail. Heads. Hey Jasper, remember when you got that one haircut? The good one? <laughs> oh, we should do that again for a video. We should like toss a coin. <sighs> no! No! Yeah, boy! Time to get a haircut. I guess so, yeah. So I got the worst rated hairdresser, but was it really gonna be that bad? In order to justify our filming, we pretended that I was an international student and Jesper was making a documentary on me. Jesper went to the best rated place, but what makes this the best? Hey. Hey. The best rated place, however, was extremely packed. Because of this, they quickly ran late, and while understandable, I can stand being late. To justify our filming here, I went with what I like to call the entrepreneur routine. So like, how much do you you enjoy being a business student? It's lovely. No, I, I think I really give up those vibes. Yeah. During my haircut, I quickly did what I always do, and I talked a lot. And I remind myself of like one of them dogs that has like the hair. I'm pretty sure my blonde is almost gone. It used to be silver, but then it turned blonde. Jasper, on the other hand, was still waiting. Were you uh, one of those kids who grew up with really blonde hair as well? Yeah, I did. But after a while, it was finally his turn. Hello. Hi. Hi. He showed the barber what he wanted, which is essentially the same thing he always has. And I decided to annoy him a little more. If you had to give like one tip to the future of banking. I think it's gold. It's the most most stable. That's all sorts of like hype around Bitcoin, mm -hmm. NFTs. Meanwhile, my hairdresser had not been able to get a single word in as I yapped along. My eye color is boring. I wish I had like one of them insane eye colors. What is the worst haircut you ever got? Remember like the first day we met? That haircut? I do. What about you, Jasper? <laughs> you, you know about this one. They cut my hair, but they kept the back really long. Then I just had a, a mullet. <laughs> and... <laughs> Did he offer you a mullet or is it like uh, he just put it there like Oh, I have that haircut, you know where we are <laughs> like um, Even you? Doubting about life, yeah, 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 sure <laughs> Part of life, you know? I don't know about that mullet story, you know? It sounds a little, <laughs> a little weird Clearly my hairdresser warmed up to us Jasper's on the other hand didn't speak much So I just kept the businessman joke going So you don't you don't own any board names? I sure as hell don't <laughs> I was also incredibly in his way. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, no fault. I do remember that one time someone cut you very like a certain Austrian dictator. Yeah, that's not, that's not what you're looking for, I guess. No. First thing I would do whenever you invest anything is to, to study. That's very smart. I know. T-Rexes aren't even the coolest dinosaurs. <laughs> no. What are the coolest dinosaurs? That's the question. Everybody has different. I'm a big fan of Triceratops. Yeah, keep eye on whatever Elon Musk is tweeting or virality and the yeah. Bugality of the, the stock. I really don't like his nose, so I blocked him on Twitter. I mean, his hair. None of it is real. I mean, it's real. He just got hair implants. It's weird that when you go to that length, you then choose that haircut. Do you like to, uh, to keep the sideburns straight? Whatever you think looks best. <laughs> Remember when you had really uh, big sideburns? And for some reason, I thought they looked really cool at the time. We always think that before switch turns. Yeah. You know, your taste uh, it changes as well, you know? Obviously, the vibes were very different. Jasper was losing a lot of hair and more and more people entered the best rated barber. Luckily, Jasper kept up his persona. Yeah, I, I don't know what I'll be eating yet. They like caviar or... <laughs> Have you ever actually had caviar? Because it's yeah. not that good. I had this brief period where like, I wore my hair like all this. You were a trendsetter on that one. <laughs> <laughs> this was where Jesper almost lost it. You see, there is a now private video in which I had friends and family eat actual gold. And the reason it's no longer up is because it's truly so bad. And between Jesper and I, this has become a bit of an inside joke. Did you know that you can actually eat gold? No, no. Yeah. That sounds like like I could make a movie out of that at some point. That sounds like something I would like have my friends try as well. Starting to look sharp. Like it. Like a fork. As my haircut was almost done, so was Jesper's. He, however, seemed like all life has left his eyes. What is some intellectual property, like a brand, that you would invest in? So there's one like kind of up and coming brand mm -hmm. mostly like kind of clothing yeah they're called cult i think i might have heard of it cult yeah. apparel i believe it's cult dot shop all right marvel is also good before i knew it my haircut was done and wet. I, I think it looks nice. Yeah, I cool. rounded this photo off for you because else it's gonna look like a bird nest, you know, just hanging yeah, all yeah. down here. And that, stuff. That, that's smart. Yeah. Yeah, I know you have nice length at the front, so you can just be funky with that, you know? Cool, cool. Jesper was also almost done as the best rated barber added some final touches and dried his hair. He also started doing th this, which probably has a good reason, but. <laughs> Yeah, it looks good. Wonderful, thank you. Yeah, it looks great. Thank you. 
I got my neck shaved, and Jesper got a metric ton of perfume. Then it was time to round up, pay, and of course, the confrontations and the reveal. Actually, the, the, the reason we went here is because we saw that it had the best ratings in the whole city. Yeah. What made that happen? Like, how do you get to the point where you have the best rated place in the city? Just make you feel like- <clears throat> Right, I didn't mention the absolute insane volume the best place a speaker system had. When you, you know you have guests at home, it can feel very, very good. Sick, awesome, thank yeah. you so much. So the reason we came here and we're also filming a little bit because this is one of the lowest rated hairdressers. Yeah. And we just wanted to see, is it, is it really that bad? Yeah. And and we don't think it is. You were really nice. Lovely, yeah. I wonder why the reviews are. It's, it's a little off sometimes, you know. It's, I think it's because there's a, a big cycle in like uh, works here, you know. There's a lot of people that come and go, you know. It goes up and down, up and down because it's just a lot of people coming in and out, you know. And people with a lot of like different qualities of work or like a different passion, you know. And I think it's all with the passion, you know. If you have passion for your work, it shows out in the results, you know. So without any further ado. Okay. It doesn't stay poofy enough. See? See what I mean? It's very limp. You know how I asked for a fringe? <laughs> and what I got was this, essentially, just revealing my massive ass forehead. <laughs> Let's wash. Hey, I'm Sherlock. This will get you used. <laughs> He's a wet little boy. It's not like it's very gappy. It's okay. But I think it works. I don't hate mine. What do we rate the worst rated barber? Vibes were good. Very. Three and a half out of five. Fair enough. What do we rate the best rated one? It's not for me. They were obviously very good at what yeah, they do. Sure. You know, I think I would go with a 3.5. Well, not to cut you short, but the video you see on your screen right now is one that YouTube thinks that you're really gonna like, so let's click it and find out whether or not they're right.